What is up everybody, welcome back to another video on the Sunk and Stuff YouTube channel. And I do want to say thank you guys so much for the support on the last videos. Like 200 views, 100, and even like 1,000. I haven't gotten a 1,000 view video in like a year, man. It's actually crazy. So today, we are going to be researching a brand new browser. Let me do this cool little transition. Ooh! Opera GX. Speaking of Opera GX, this video is sponsored by Opera I know that it's been under some heavy controversy, and no, this video is not sponsored by Opera GX. So, here's what I'm going to do. Right now, I just got connected to a VPN for one reason and one reason only. Because I'm scared this might collect my data. <laughs> Privacy and security, let's see this. It's Opera Browser safe. No, they're not because I've already watched a dozen videos. Um, crypto mining scripts? Alright. We'll see if all this is true. So, I know that the VPN is a scam already. The ad blocker is not fake. Tracker blocker. Mm, I mean, it does have a lot of trackers, the Chinese government and stuff, so I don't really trust that. I'm going to actually. Review Opera GX instead of normal Opera. Like, as you can see here, Opera Browser. So this is the normal Opera, right here. But I'm going to try Opera GX, the browser for gamers. So enough talking, and let's get right into it. I don't know. So it's got a red dot award and an if award. Okay, options. If it downloads a virus on my computer, I'm going to be so mad. So I, so I know that these CPU and RAM orders are fake, so... Yeah, that's not really good. Like, it seems way too good to be true. Like, a free VPN? Like... No thanks. So, we're running Opera right now. Hello! How are you? So, right here, close other tabs. Duh. Already, I'm getting bombarded with a lot of stuff right now. GX.me? Alright. Game strips. No! What is this? Don't show again. Suck to what? Aria! Aria. What's the Aria? Um, hello. Um, is op Opera GX safe? Bro, it's actually struggling. I think it knows. I'm gonna stop the response. Well, again, I have to watch. No, no. GX control. Alright. So I can limit how much RAM this uses. Twitch. Mo mo what is mods? What is this? Keyboard sounds? What? What even is this? No, I mean, how you to how you browse? No. Oh, uh, I don't think I really like that. I know that I'm being critical already, but it's because I, I know that it's a pretty shady company. Like, I wouldn't be this critical if I didn't know, like, what it had done. So I'm using a VPN right now. I think Opera GX has something. Let me see this. So, when you open your search history, right here, redeem my soul. Start the afterlife on a queen slate. Fake my history feature, except that if you're still browsing, you're still alive. Stop 14 consecutive days and we'll assume you're dead. Or using a different browser. In that case, you'll just be dead to us. As a parting gift, you will auto delete your browsing history and replace with a totally fake but nice version. Think volunteer work, single source chocolate, and composting home. A rose tinted redux of your web life, even if it's little embellished. As in the browse, or, or in the after browse. That sounds like a ritual, bro. What? I mean, kind of is, theoretically. 
but mm, I don't know. So first of all, browser bench benchmarks. Browserbench.org. So first of all, speedometer. You know how this goes. We are just going to wait. Alright, so it's on a 11.8. So let me compare it to the last grade comparison video. 13.7. So, so it actually got improved by quite a bit actually. Now let's try that on Opera. And 10.1? Why not actually not expect this? So it's actually a lot faster. That's crazy. What? Alright, alright, alright. It's not looking too good for Brave so far. Actually I think it is looking good for Brave because you know, all because of all the privacy stuff. We've already tested about privacy. You know what? I am actually going to do this. So first of all, now I am going to try. First of all, the acid three test. Let's see this. Oh, 97. All right. So now, what? Wait, what? So, Brave doesn't even work. Brave's acid three test doesn't even work. What? That's crazy. What? How is it not working? It's working on here. What? Are you serious? What? How is it not working? Wait, 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 what? No. Your connection is not private. Wait a second. So what website was I on back then? What? 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 How? So I guess what I'm going to have to do the acid three test on a different website. Because I I literally can't. I would What? HTTPS. So HTTP? Is that it? No, well, let's take the acid two test. Hello world. And compare to the reference rendering. So, all right. So it looks normal. Acid two. All right. They basically have no difference. Oh my god, man. Motion mark. I guess we're right, so I guess we're just gonna be waiting. So, so. Actually no 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 no. Browser audit. Alright. Test me. Alright, let's see. Did it? Whoa. So you guys want to see these test results, copy this link right here. Information. So I make concern to be personal. This IP address is actually the one that got linked to me here in Europe. So I will a browser audit here and let's do this. Okay, so it finished. 30 warnings while Opera's 31 warnings. So one more warning. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't really do much. So what is this even about? Oh, so a wide variety of security standards and features. So since I really can't find another one, I'm going to do something which I never wanted to do. End this video, yeah. So I'm going to be ending this video today. So, who will I 
going to be changing, and we're also going to be implementing something new in, in the videos. At the end, I'm going to pick which one I want, and also I'm going to give them a rating. So my overall score that I'm going to be rating is unfortunately a 3 out of 10. You know what, I'm going to be generous. A 4 out of 10. I would have given it like a 7 or an 8, or an 8 out of 10. If it wasn't for all the privacy concerns that I've heard about it and stuff, which has been proven. So, yeah. What's Graves rating? So, Graves rating is in fact going to be an 8 out of 10. An 8 or an 8.5 out of 10. I didn't rate it. I know, I know, I only rated Opera, but, but in general, Brave is an 8.5. It has just the right amount of co uh, customizability, not too much and not too little. I think it's actually like really secure. Plus with the VPN, it's great secure actually. And it also has something which I don't think I'll ever need, but it's an, an extra little thing of security I guess. There's a private window with Tor browser. So, yeah. That's basically the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye bye.